So I'm going to try uh, showing you some of the uh, capabilities of using an AI tool for doing some coding. So here I'm using a free AI IDE called Cursor. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up a new folder. So I'm going to um, just create a new, what I'm going to do here is um, I'm going to open a folder. And I'm going to call it um, AI bot. And here I'm going to basically instruct um, the uh, cursor based composer tool to create a um, Java project that would calculate the sales tax on certain items. So I'm going to say, uh, create a Java console application with the currently installed JDK um, prompt, okay, use um, Maven as the build and run configuration. Um, prompt the user for the um, item name, total, total cost, and tax rate, sales tax rate, sales tax rate, and then output the resulting total cost with the sales tax, sales tax to the standard output. So let's see how well this can do. So here it's actually kind of specifying how it's going to create out the, um, the project and actually it's actually also specifying some of the code. So here um, I can see that um, if I scroll up here, it's specifying the Maven project folder. It's showing me the sample of the Maven file. Um, here is the entry point of calling our program. And then here is the place where we are um, prompting the user for the sales tax and so forth. Um, this probably won't match, this does not match what I had specified as a sample code for the classroom, um, but this nevertheless is, hopefully is a functioning program. So here it's gonna give me some sample outputs. So here I can either reject it all, all these changes, or I can accept them all. So I'm going to accept them all. So fail to save content as a newer file. Okay, so I'm just gonna say overwrite because I really don't care about what's there before. Okay, so here um, it's showing that there's some syntax errors. So let's try to resolve these. I'm going to close this panel here. So sales calculator is here inside of com example package. Go back here. Well, now it's actually resolved it. Okay. So now if I go back to the console here for the AI and actually I run it this way. So let's say I copy this. I can actually specify run here. Let's actually run it. A little bit of um, warning, but not nothing to worry about. Here I can then run it. So it's saying item name. Um, let's see. Snicker bar cost. I'll say two dollars and uh, fifty ten cents. Sales tax rate. I'm just gonna put something like twelve point. I mean, 5.25, and then here it's telling me uh, the output, sales receipt, item, base cost, um, 
tax amount, and then total cost. So here, this is uh, nevertheless a working Java console program um, that can be done pretty easily using cursor.